Discover Wagla, hottest city in Africa. Wagla is the capital city of Wagla province in southern Algeria. It has a flourishing petroleum industry and hosts one of Algeria's biggest universities, the University of Wagla. With an average daily high temperature of 30 degrees Celsius, Wagla is one of Algeria's hottest regions. Temperatures are consistently over 25 degrees Celsius for several months of the year, with temperatures consistently reaching 27 degrees Celsius and occasionally up to 44 degrees and due to the warmer temperatures, the best time for traveling is from June to August and what makes it unattractive for tourists are the cold months of November to March. Hello Displorers, welcome to another interesting video. If you are new here, please ensure to subscribe by clicking the subscription button below. Give this video a thumbs up too and if you are interested in such contents, feel free to check on our previous videos as we upload contents like this every day. History of Wagla the city was a significant tourist attraction and many tourists shopped for sand roses at the old rock market that had many traditional shops filled with antiquities, traditional crafts and local items from dresses to stuffed lizards. The area across from these shops was used to display sand roses, mineral specimens of all sizes and shapes, but the market has gone through a renovation process. Not far from the old rock market is the old groceries market or the Sunday market as it is called by the locals and it is also located in the center of the old city, La Casbar, and at its center, the original old market is shaped at a circle split into small arcs. The central circular structure is now a meat market, surrounded by rows of grocers and farmers' shops displaying all sorts of fruit and vegetables. Next to the old groceries market lie the two oldest mosques of the city, al Mashid al Atik, which literally means the old mosque, and the old Ibadi mosque, home to one of the most renowned Islamic scholars of the city, Taleb Ed Tayeb. The Wakli language, which is part of the northern Beba languages, is an Ati subgroup, which is spoken by some of Wakli's residents and Ingusa. There are also Wakli speakers. Climate Wakla has a desert climate typical of the Sahara Desert, in which it is located, and summers in the city are long and hot, while winters are short and pleasant. The city's average temperatures are the highest among Algeria's major cities, including Wagla. The hottest month is in July, with a temperature of roughly 43 degrees Celsius, while summer brings continuous and oppressive heat, with temperatures occasionally topping 49 degrees Celsius. For more than 135 days, the city of Wagla has had temperatures equal to or more than 35 degrees Celsius, and for more than 83 days, it has had temperatures equal to or greater than 38 degrees Celsius. The year with the most days recorded with a temperature of more than 38 degrees Celsius was in 2014 with 99 days, while the year with the fewest was 1981 with 39 days. Since 1963, the city of Carpentras in France has experienced a total of 16 days with temperatures equivalent to or above 38 degrees Celsius, and on July 31, 2005, the highest minimum temperature recorded at Wagla was 36.6 degrees Celsius and on August 13, 1984, the highest temperature was 53.5 degrees Celsius. The hot, dry and sunny climate can make this beautiful city very interesting during the winter compared to the icy winter that the north of the country can experience. On average, days with a minimum temperature below 0 degrees Celsius are uncommon in Wagla, but however, when one gets further from Wagla's metropolitan region, frost becomes considerably more common in the city's outskirts. The record for the number of days below zero was set in 1983, when there were 7 days in January and 7 days in December for a total of 14 days below zero. Culture The Garamantes were the first people to live in the Sahara, and because various people have settled at Wetmia, the inhabitants of Wagla are known as the Mandahin and are likely ancestors of the Garamantes mixed with much more of African and Caucasian people. The Beni Ibrahim, who live in the northern district, are said to be Berbers across with Sudanese. The Beni Waguin and the Beni Sizin of the east and south districts would also count among their ancestors. Berbers from the north, at the time of the first Muslim conquest, took their place alongside the first inhabitants in the 10th century. Various types of music are native to Wakla, which is one of the most popular, originating in the western part of the country, which combines varying instrumentation with simple poetic lyrics. Both men and women are free to express themselves in this style, and one especially popular Algerian singer, Khaled, has exported this music to Europe and the United States. Religion The majority of Wakla are Muslims. However, other Berber groups such as the Kabyles, Shawiya, Tuareg and other Saharan Berbers 
are only nominally Muslim. The observances of Islamic law are generally lax. The concept of Baraka or holiness is highly developed in North Africa and the Berbers believe that many people are endowed with Baraka, of which the holiest are the Sharifa or the direct descendants of Muhammad. Wagla Oasis The Wagla Oasis receives its water from the underlying Northward Sahara Aquifer, a water-bearing rock layer that stretches under Algeria, Tunisia and Libya. Inhabitants of the Wagla Oasis have regularly sunk boreholes into the aquifer to tap its resources for irrigation. Beginning late in the 20th century, however, the rate of well drilling increased the levels deemed unsustainable by United Nations Environment Programme. Continued drilling was expected to increase the salt content of the upper layer of the water table, which would ultimately harm the irrigated vegetation. There you have it, explorers. If you found this video interesting, please leave a like and don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and click the bell icon so as to be notified when next we drop a new video. And feel free to check our previous videos on the channel as we upload daily. Thanks for watching.